Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to a specific game that I purchased for five dollars, and I I love it. I'm pretty sure you saw it through the Kanemari one. Welcome to Guacamole. It's a game. I gave it a few minutes uh, before I actually started to give it a little practice, see what kind of game it is. And let me tell you, I love the controls. In oh my god, it's really great. It. In a sense, it feels kind of like the Subspace Emissary from Super Smash Bros. Brawl. But at the same time, it's a mix of um, Rayman Legends for the PS3 as well. But besides that, oh my god, let me tell you guys. You guys are going to enjoy the hell out of this game. But there's one thing. I'm just going to let you guys know. Seizure fucking warning. Because this game will give you a seizure. I didn't expect for it to give you a seizure like as bad as I thought it was going to be. Oh, why am I not hearing any sound? Oh, wait, that's right. Do I... Blah? I'm supposed to hear sound. I'm hearing sound through the TV. How come I'm not hearing sound through the... Are you okay? Head headphones? You okay? I don't know. As of this first episode, you guys will be hearing the game audio. I'm sorry if it sounds a little weird or whatever. But, whatever. Let's go ahead and start. This game is fantastic. Uh, the Mexican theme and everything like that. It, oh my god, it's amazing. I uh, can't tell you how much I like this game already. But, um... Basically, you could, um, not only that, I, uh, immediately fell in love with it. Oh my god, it's running at 60 frames on my TV screen, even if 1080, what the fuck? It's running at 1080i. Huh. <laughs> but, basically, you're a man named Juan, and, um, that's pretty much it. And, okay, so immediately, like, this is what I see what it is so far. It's, um... It's memes, it's um, it's um, Rayman, it's Smash Bros, it's um, it's a lot of things. And this particular, like, opening reminds me a lot of, um, what's that one game? No, it's not a game, it's a movie. It reminds me a lot of that one Jack Black film. What was called? Fucking, the bad one with the, trying to be, Mexican one. I forgot the title. Nacho Libre, that's what it was called. The music and the atmosphere feels like not Nacho. But whatever. But I did not complete the game, I can tell you that. Um but let me tell you you're I'm gonna get lost a lot. So <laughs> I barely touched it. Just like Sonic Heroes, I barely touched this game. I don't know what I'm coming up to. Um I hope you guys are ready for this. Um, if you guys really want to read the text, you can freaking press the pause button. I'm not freaking gonna freaking read the text. It takes too much time. And I want to show gameplay because the gameplay is amazing. You guys are gonna you you're gonna like it. Trust me. Oh my god, it's like. <laughs> but yeah. Oh my eyes. Ah, this game is fantastic. I can just leave it like that. You guys hearing me gush like this? Oh my god, at least they- Oh, fucking, are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Basically, the plot is the president's daughter has been kidnapped by- You'll see right now in a bit. The president's daughter has been kidnapped by this guy. And if I remember her name correctly, La Calavera? Uh, we'll see right now. Silencio. Living the world, blah blah blah. Calaca, that's what it was. What the hell's a calavera? <laughs> I'm Carlos Calaca. Uh, basically, I don't know why he takes the person his daughter. Caesar warning! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god. And you died already. Game over. That's the game. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm just kidding. It's not the end of the game. But, 
you are in Death Town, USA. I can tell you that. And um, and you can actually switch characters in this game. I'll show you which character model I'm playing as because obvious reasons. Pueblucha. Anyways, we're almost there, and there you go. So this is the Mask of Truth, if I remember correctly. I don't even know. Fucking. I am playing as her, basically. Um, she is Tostada, and she is the female lead. I don't know. I don't know if you you literally just swapped your gender or whatever or not. <laughs> but let me tell you, that the art of this game, beautiful. It, it's so well made. <laughs> but yeah I'm sorry if you guys hear stuff in the background grandma's home <laughs> but yeah this town's under attack blah 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 and you guys know what to do I'm sorry like I said <laughs> in the background sounds but yeah this is the start of the can I dodge? yeah I can dodge already Woo! Oh, wait, I'm supposed to go this way. Because the house is already on fire. Oh, wait, no, I'm supposed to save the minister. And this is basically your tutorial, what you learn. And how to fight. And bam, and then you throw them up, and then just bam, you get some coins right there. Bada ba bam. And then I'll leave that, and then it comes too. You, you dodge. You dodge correctly. And then you grab it, and you throw it at him. And then you do more attacks. You look at this. Oh snap, I thought he was dead. <laughs> and then for this guy, you dodge. And then you dodge, uh, you dodge again. Oh uh, snap. And then it becomes, oh uh, snap. <laughs> Gosh, I already got hurt. Bam, bam, bam. Bam. Yeah, bam. Give me shit, pow. Eh? Look at that bundle. Oh, <laughs> God, that scared me. <laughs> but yeah, so you open the door and whatnot, and then there you go. I guess you saved everybody or whatever. But um, ah, oh, this game is great. I can tell you that. And then there's also submissions for some reason. Um, I can see for the playability for this guy. This guy's basically asking for chickens and whatnot. I don't know why chickens, <laughs> but. Yeah, um, what is there? Uh, so right now we're heading off to the first temple, as you guys could already tell. Uh, but basically, this is all I know so far. I only know up to the first temple, and I only did like probably like half a section of it afterwards, which is pretty much it. Um, what time is it? Eight minutes? Okay. So I'm going to see if I can do this in the 15 minutes, because I really, really want to do this play through whoa oh, okay because <laughs> i saw this game in the game Informer magazine and i was like oh guacamole it looks really fun and it's a like i said it's a multiplayer game or i didn't i don't think i ever said that i don't think oh wait i could swatch characters right now in a bit give me a sec bam and i feel like this is kind of like the street fighter um in a sense it's like street fighter but not at the same time. Like I said, it's. I feel like it's more like uh, it's like Smash Bros. Rayman Legends. I don't know what the heck this game is. It's like all different types of genres put together. Ouch! <laughs> it's all different type of genres put together. Um, the way you um, get more life back, you um, you open some kind of crate of some kind. Uh, Luchador, blah blah blah. This is Tiger Man. I don't know. I guess this. Do you know how I am? No, I don't. I'm gonna basically mimic what I did in the first one. I don't even know who he is, anyways. Yeah, I don't know what's the deal with that guy. I feel like we're gonna have to fight him eventually. And there you go, costumes. There you go. I'm playing as her. Well, how much money do I have? I have no money. <laughs> I feel I haven't touched this water yet. I don't think I want to touch it. I feel it either might decrease my life, and <laughs> I suck. <laughs> It's, I think it'll either decrease my life or um, or it'll be an instant kill. And I don't want to figure... It, oh, okay. 
Okay. I did not know that. And that's the only thing I don't like. It's the fact that there's no like duck animation. Like every movement, everything else, super smooth. It's just the duck. <laughs> but whatever. So uh, let's see how much. How much fuel do I have? I only have a little. And you throw it down, and then trick shot, pa, pa, and then you throw it again. The more combos you do, the more money you'll get. Um, so that's why I suggest you to get a lot of money because trust me these upgrades seem like hard but basically there's oh there's one of the reasons why I said like it's kind of like smash Bros. because for some reason you have an air dodge and it's literally like an air dodge in smash bros <laughs> and then battlefield and then you throw this guy and throw him backwards and then you can punch this guy and then throw him up for it to freaking destroy them all. Gotta kill them all. <laughs> and bam, and then chip pop 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 ha. Pop pop. Whoa. Come on, grab him. <laughs> I missed him. And you throw him. And then pop pop pop. And then bam. And then you grab. Oh. Oh. Oh, the, the guy that you saw on the left screen right now. He's a character you'll later see. And for some reason, the reward is Pinata with points in it. <laughs> I don't know why. It's hilarious. I do like that a lot. But yet again, I feel it's really racist because I'm Mexican as well. But yet again, this game can be made by Mexicans. Why am I to judge? I got 600. I feel like I had enough abilities. Nope, yet. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh, Smash Bros. Smash Bros. Logic. And then you come over here and just uh, come up here and just charge your chest. You can destroy it for more cool. All I know is this so far, like I said, that statue before- I'm sorry, I come with that statue too fast. That was literally like a freaking- <laughs> That was like literally a Metroid reference. Like, I feel like the creators of this had literally, literally like decided to put like all the genres of all types of <laughs> games. I didn't notice his pants like fell on slowly. But basically- Oh, seizure warning. Up upcoming seizure warning. I hope you guys don't get a seizure. God damn it. I stared at the screen and it hurt my eyes. Ready for it? Seizure warning. And now. Oh my god, my eyes. Oh, I hope you guys aren't. I put the warning, so it's up to you guys. <laughs> if you want to listen to it. Bam. And oh, you will, for your special moves, you do have stamina. So you will eventually run out. And I can't break through that yet. But besides that, we're heading off to the first temple, and I feel like that's enough. Um, these loot out this game. But, um, yeah, if you guys like this game, you guys could check it out. It's at the game PlayStation Network. It's only, uh, right now that I'm aware, uh, probably by the time it's this up. Oh, you know what? No, I'll probably update this uh, immediately. Um, this game right now is on sale for $4, I believe, and it's really worth it. In my opinion but I mean like I said it's up to you guys where are you there you are BAM oh BAM and then BAM I learned a specific combo on my personal playthrough let's see what it was It wasn't that one, but something similar to that. I believe there are certain combos you can only learn then, alone, uh, separate times. But, um, let's see. Bam! Oh, I missed. <laughs> but like I said, I love the art for this game. This game's art fits it so perfectly. Let's see. Bam. Oh, man. I like this dodge roll. It's like really effective really quick. And then throw him again. And then bam. See, this contr these controls, they're not so bad to learn actually. They're really, really easy. Um, if you guys are wondering why I'm glowing red, I'm pretty sure you guys already figured it out. If not, um, 
the reason I'm going red is because you do, like I said, you have a stamina meter. So you will, um, the more you use your, uh, your special moves, you run out of stamina like really quickly. But first I want to increase my health because she's health is crucial in this game. And then you throw this guy and you throw it over there. Oh, that's right. By throwing people, you don't necessarily only throw one. You throw all of them. Uh, if it hits one person, it doesn't only hit one person. It hits multiple targets. So, bam, bam, bam. See, look at that. Bam. 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 I got 160 hits. See, look at that. And pinata time. <laughs> but I'll be upgrading multiple stats at the same time. Um, I would have gotten some trophies at this point, but like I said, I've been playing this already and whatnot, but freaking whatever. I'm just going to go ahead and move on. <laughs> I do like that whole brand tequila thing. I think this game is rated E10 or it's either, um, teen. I feel it might be teen because a lot of the language here seems a little strong. For children to understand. Not only that, the mix of Spanish and English at the same time. <laughs> but oh, but yeah, we're about to head off to the next stage. But first, we gotta learn combos because you know every platformer needs you to learn about combos that you don't need to know. <laughs> blah blah blah. Basic free hunt combo. <laughs> I like how Poncho. Not Poncho, Poncho. <laughs> is a zombie of some sort. I guess he's dead. I don't like the fact that pa, pa, uh, that the chicken talks though. That's kind of strange. But now it's time for the air combo. I, oh, actually, you'll show you'll show the guys the combo that I was talking about, which is really cool. I did it. Bam! There is he. There you go. And then this one's up. And jump, square, square, bam. And then circle, and then square, square, square. And then, ready for this? Square, circle, square. Oh, damn. <laughs> square, X, or eh. Oh, damn, I messed it up. All right, this time it's good. Bam, bam. Oh, <laughs> god damn it. These combos are kind of eh. Ah, oh, damn. Eh. Eh, 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 eh. I was trying to do that earlier. <laughs> it is really easy, like he says. At least you're not pressing. I'm hoping you don't have to press multiple buttons at the same time. But said, oh wait, that chicken had a quest. I didn't even know that. Oh wait, I have to. Huh? Uh, oh, what the heck? Wait, I can learn more combos? I did not know that. Square up, circle, circle, square. Oh damn, I almost had it. Uh, uh, ah, oh, damn. Okay. Uh, 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 damn it. Uh, 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 uh. Oh man. These combos are cool. Eh, eh, eh. Wait, what? Uh, uh, uh. One, two, three. Oh, damn. One, two, three. What the heck? How do you learn that? This is actually kind of hard. Uh, uh, uh. Damn it. <laughs> One, two, three. L2. Up. Square, square, square. Oh. Oh, he gives me money for learning specific combos. I'm not learning any more combos because I'm running out of time. I've been recording for 20 minutes. Holy crap, this game is great. <laughs> Closed? Why is it closed? Can I only do it a certain amount of times? I guess. <laughs> oh, okay. Basically, uh, Skeleton Here Man is uh, upgrade, so if you want to upgrade, go ahead and talk to this guy. Besides that, we're almost at the end of our video. Um, so you guys know what to do. I'm sorry for the background, you guys. Uh, oh. Huh. Huh. Behind that mask lies the soul of a punching poet. Charisma and discount and Fernando's. Oh, wait, they have skills? High flying kicks. Street smarts. 
I didn't even know that. Oh, that's cool. I can't... Oh, man. Can't wait to get more into details of this game. Like I said, I'm going to be playing for this... Why does that seem so familiar? Anyways. <laughs> um, hope you guys enjoyed this game. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. You guys know what to do. Hit that like button a lot of times. Whatever. But, oh, man. Can't wait to... Uh, so much fun. Okay. All right, then, guys. Next time on Guacamelee, we're going to go ahead and go to the next area. So I'll see you guys then. <laughs> Me gusta guavas. <laughs>